tell you a little, uh, some of the lessons that I hope you can walk away with. You better be paying attention all the time. You better be watching what's going on, not only within your own organization, but outside your organization. Because every once in a while, these freak storms come along. Have any of you ever experienced a freak storm? Something that just came out of the blue? Please raise your hand just to let me know that you're listening. If you've not experienced it, then you've got to wake up because this stuff is happening around you. And some of you, I suspect, have gotten phone calls while you've been even in this conference over the last two days about something that's going on at home that might be a freak storm. Anybody get that phone call since you've been here? Okay. Now, some of you are probably thinking, there's a storm brewing and I hope I don't get the call. But that's the environment that we live in. The next thing is, is that every once in a while even our friends dump on us. This poor little bird got itself in a pickle, but the nice friendly cow came along and dumped on it. Now every once in a while we're going to have our friends dump on us and they're going to make the situation that we're in already even a little bit worse. But you've got to remember, they're still your friends and probably the ones that are going to help you get out of it, just like the cow did. The other thing that I think is important to remember is, is that every once in a while your enemies rescue you. Do any of you have enemies out there that would love to have your neck? Raise your hand. Okay, we're not talking about family members, we're talking about people in the community. Okay, there are people out there that are lying in wait. They're hoping that you step in it. They're hoping that you get covered in the cow crap. Now, they're going to have an option. They're either going to pile on or they're going to come and try to help you out. But, but remember, they're your enemies. And those folks at some point in time have got their own reason for saving you. And just like the case in, well, with this cat, it was looking for a meal. Don't become the meal. Now, the last thing is, is that at the end of the day, just like this bird, you know, every once in a while we do find ourselves in a pile of crap. We find ourselves kind of entombed. We're looking around. We're trying to figure out what's going on. It seems like the world's coming to an end. Sometimes the best thing to do is just to keep our mouth shut.